So I made a mess over here, which is fine. It's fine. It's fine. Woo! Woo -hoo -hoo! Almost dropped that pin. Mmm. 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 Oh, so. Yo, what up, Hammies? Welcome back to another episode of Amateur Cook Attempts to Make Professional Chef Recipes. On today's episode, we're trying the one and only Chrissy Teigen Spicy Miso Pasta. I'm pretty excited to try this recipe out because it's like a carbonara with some Asian infusion and she uses a Vietnamese ingredient, which I'm Viet. Excited to try this one out. So let's head off to the kitchen to start cooking. We got all the ingredients here. There's not a long list, so hopefully the recipe is as simple as what it looks like. I'm excited to say that Chrissy's using a Vietnamese classic, Duong Ai, Sambal Olek in English. We use it a lot in Vietnamese cooking, so I'm excited to see how that mixes with the American Italian pasta. First things first, we gotta, you know, boil some water, because that always takes the longest, right? I'm gonna grab a pot, um, fill that up with some water, and then get that on the stove. I'm gonna bring that pasta water over to the stove. Turn that baby up. Large burner, medium high. Boiling water always takes forever. <laughs> so while that water's boiling, we're gonna do some prep. You know, get all the things, you know, cut and chopped up out of the way so we're not like fumbling around later because you know me, I'll be uh, very frazzled. Chop up that green onion. <laughs> Easy enough. Got that sliced up into a clean bowl. Cleanish bowl. Like so, ow. Next up, we gotta grate up some Parmigiano Reggiano. You're supposed to use a real parm. You see on the rind, it like says Parmigiano Reggiano there. Unless you don't got it, then you really can't use it. So use what you got. Grate this up in here. Ah, look how nice these shavings are. I made a mess, like always. You wanna take guesses if the water boiled yet? No. Who doesn't love bacon? Like what a great recipe. Bacon, egg, basically breakfast in a pasta. How much is four ounces? 12 ounces divided by three is four. Four ounces, so three, one third. How many slices? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Ten. Ten slices. So about three, four slices. We'll do four slices, because we love bacon here. So get your knife, slice open this package. Um, okay. Get a sharp knife so it actually cuts open. Oh. Four bacon. Four bacons? We'll do five bacons because we like bacon. Why not? Go big or go home, they say. Dice that up or chop it up into little pieces. Not little, but I guess. So Chrissy did a uh, Instagram story on this and it's John Legend approved, so must be good. Real fatty. What is next? What is next? What is next? We're gonna mix up the sauce ingredients. So we got the sambal thing in there. We got the miso in. Ooh. And then we got the hot water. Pour that in there. My mom is staring at me like crazy over there. And we're gonna mix that up. Oh yeah, look at that. Does not look that appetizing to be honest, but smells delicious. Mm. And then to here, we're gonna add some egg. Crack in these eggs one at a time. Don't get the shells in. Oh, and I got a shell in there. Oops. These eggs are not cracking well. Where'd you buy these eggs, mom? <laughs> these around, get all that incorporated. So pretty simple. You're just putting things together, stirring it up. Not too bad. Over to the stove and do the real cooking. Our water is boiling very vigorously. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. And we're gonna put in the pasta. So I got some thin spaghetti, spaghetti, whatever pasta works. Throw it in there. Oh, maybe do it a little nicer than that. And you know, just using the best utensil known to man, the chopstick, and gonna make sure it's all getting some love in. Oh, I didn't salt the water. Ah, no worries, just gonna throw in some salt, generously salted. Oh, I'm supposed to cook some bacon too. Shoo, I'm all over the place. So I just grabbed the skillet, and we're gonna turn it on. I'm throwing in that oil um, into this pan, letting that heat up a little bit. I went to check the recipe on her website and it said two ounces. This is only 0.8. We gonna be grinding some more, grating some more cheese up in here. Watch your fingers. Ah! Like I just said, watch your fingers. I'm clumsy. So I made a mess over here, which is fine. It's fine, it's fine. Woo! Woo -hoo -hoo. Almost dropped that pin. So that looks like it's not hot yet. The pasta's almost done. Timer's about to go off. This is hot. Put that bacon in there. Some bacon love. Ooh, baby. Was that supposed to sizzle? We gotta reserve some pasta water. Uh, liquid gold, they call it. So we're just gonna take some of that out. 
Put that aside and we're gonna drain the pasta out. Bacon be sizzling, break that up. Look at that bacon sizzle, 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 baby. Bacon takes a while to cook. <laughs> Smells delicious, bacon and fat, you know. Oh yeah, it's crispy now. Oh yeah, make sure you don't get bacon grease up on you. So I think our bacon is there. Turn this down a little bit so they don't burn. Throw in that pasta. Mix it all up in there. Add in this egg mixture and then turn it to low so they don't scramble. So we'll quickly turn that to low. Mix that around. This part makes me nervous because I don't want no scrambled eggs in my pasta. Ooh, you can smell that sambal and the miso. Ooh, and that all mixed incorporated. Some little scrambled eggs, I think. Is that right? Oh no. So now we're gonna add in the cheese. That's a lot of cheese. It looks like a lot of cheese. Half a cup of pasta water. Peppa. Mix it around. <laughs> My mom said not to stir so hard. I think we're done. We just gotta garnish it up, baby. It smells really good, so plate it up. Put that there. Oh, that's heavy. Place some on there. Try to be neat about it, but that's a struggle for me. Oh yeah. Grab some of those bacon bits, put that on top. Yes. I'm gonna sprinkle that with some scallions. Put that, was I supposed to put the scallions in there or on top? Oh, I was supposed to put scallions in the sauce. Oopsies. Do that real quick. My bad, Chrissy, I forgot that step. Anyway, so we garnish that on top and then we're just gonna put some Parmesan rinds, flakes on top. Just look at that. Uh, I might have scrambled the eggs. Chrissy, is this is this the right consistency of the uh, noodles? I just supposed to have the little scrambled bits in there. Uh, I might mess that up. Taste it. Oh, overboard. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh, so good. Oh, it's so creamy. Oh, and the bacon salty. Oh, with that miso gives it a nice little funk. Oh, props to you, Chrissy. This is delicious. Mm. Now we're gonna give it to my parents for a taste test. We got mom, we got dad, we got Chrissy Teigen's miso sambal chili carbonara pasta. Asian carbonara. Mm. Ah. Ooh. Mm. No, actually, after taste is very good. Very good. Very good? I like it. I like it. Mom? Yeah, very, uh, very ngong. Ngong? No. What does that mean? Very good. Delicious. Very good. Delicious? Uh huh. I'm gonna have second. Ooh. Overall, I really enjoyed this recipe. I mean, it's super simple to make and she uses a Vietnamese ingredient, so two thumbs up from me here. If you do like spice, I don't think it was that spicy, so you could easily add more sambal to kick up that heat level just a little bit. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that subscribe button and the little notification bell um, so you don't miss any of our future uploads. Uh, comment below on what you want to see me cook or bake next and give this video a thumbs up. That's it for today and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.